The Senior Maths Challenge took place today and people always ask me what are the grade boundaries going to be, when are they going to come out. Now I don't know what score will get you exactly a bronze, a silver and a gold certificate this year, but it is quite consistent from year to year. And over at the Mathsora's website I've compiled a table with lots of uh, past grade boundaries and I'm trying to also keep a record of when the results come out each year so you can know roughly uh, how long it takes. They've been getting quite quick with it in recent years. I expect in the next week or so you will be able to uh, have a look at those certificate boundaries. But what you should do today, or at least as soon as that paper is made uh, public, don't talk about the solutions until then, please. But you can go through, uh, they will publish that solutions document a couple of days after the challenge, and you can see what your score is because you can work it out using the scoring system there. Um, and again, I've got a video on the main page of the website that really talks you through the scoring if you're not sure how to do that. Uh, and you can work out what your score is. Then when the results do come out, you can compare them and you will know exactly uh, what certificate you've got uh, at that point, even before it's been confirmed uh, by your school. And just to be clear, when it says 56 or 72 or whatever it is for that certificate boundary, if you get exactly that score, you do get the certificate. People ask me that a lot as well. Um, so it's the minimum that you need uh, to get that certificate value that is uh, posted there. So I hope it went well. Most of all, I hope you enjoyed the problems. I'm looking forward to hearing from you all how it went. It was great to see some of you in the live classes and loads of you over at the courses website preparing uh, in that free course as well. So I hope that was useful to you uh, and let me know when you get your results.